Cool J once again, and this is my NFC Divisional Playoffs preview. Where tomorrow, if, if you guys know tomorrow, since you guys are football fans, tomorrow, January 15th, it will be the Green Bay Packers versus the Atlanta Falcons. And also on January 16th, on Sunday, it will be the Seattle Seahawks and the Chicago Bears. Now, let's talk about uh, tomorrow's uh, football football game. Okay, so you got the Packers and the Falcons. Um, this this these teams these two teams right here, as you guys know that um, according to the Falcons, they have the best record in the NFC in the NFC. So you know, of course, they wouldn't even be in the wild cards, but still, they're here. Now everybody knows how the Green Bay Packers got here. They had to beat the Philadelphia Eagles, which everybody knows it was a close, really close game between the Eagles and the Packers. To, to go against the Falcons. Now, this game right here, uh, the Packers and the Falcons, I have to, um, you know, the Packers, they're good, but, but at the same time, I don't really think they're going to pass the Falcons right here. I think Atlanta is going to, is going to beat, beat the Green, uh, blah, it's got that mixed up right there, but let me say this again. I think the Falcons are going to beat the Packers, and they're going to go to the, <clears throat> the NFC Championship by by a close game. Uh, I wouldn't say like this that the Falcons would would, <laughs> would automatically just dominate the Packers if the edge does happen tomorrow. But I could see this, you know, a really close game. And you know, if you're a football fan, you're gonna say this is really a good game. So I know Green Bay, Atlanta is on. But I would have to say Atlanta. Now. On Sunday, you have the Seattle Seahawks and the Chicago Bears. Now, of course, the Seattle Seahawks had to get to the playoffs by defeating the New Orleans Saints, who are who are the defending champions in the NFL. But since <coughs> since they got eliminated, we will have a new Super Bowl champion in um, in 2010 NFL season. Well, the postseason actually. In 2011, so yeah, so so between the Seattle Seahawks and the Chicago Bears, I gotta say the Bears. Why do I say the Bears? Is because okay, one, the Bears are above 500. Yeah, their average is above 500. For the Seahawks, they're not. The Seahawks are like below 500. So why would I expect the Seahawks to actually beat the Bears to go to the NFC Championship game? I don't really see the Seattle Seahawks going <laughs> doing anything to be honest. I mean, of course they beat the Saints, but but you know, but that's the Saints. Let's let's see what they do with against the Bears, and and let's see you know if it's gonna snow in Chicago because <coughs> Chicago Bears know they have experienced snow time <coughs> during their game. So let's see what happens. But still, I see the Chicago the Chicago Bears bearing. Burying the the Seattle Seahawks, so that's just me. So yeah, that's really I gotta say about that. I already see the Chicago Bears versus the Atlanta Falcons in an NFC Championship game. And as I already gotta say, who you guys think is gonna win, and who you guys think is gonna go to the NFC Championship game? Falcons, Bears, Seahawks, Packers. Who's going to the NFC Championship game? Let me know what you guys think. You know what I'm saying? Come to me on Facebook, MySpace, and Twitter. And Skype me, I look who JJ Jabari. And, you know, make sure you check out the Sports News Today show. You know what I'm saying? Well, I was about to say, check out the Scripts Box right there. <laughs> the Scripts Box is right over here. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Check out the Sports News Today show, 6 p.m. Eastern on Saturday, all right? On Saturday, 6 p.m. Eastern. And, yeah, cool day's out. Peace.